Hello all, Sirius Lees here, back with some more of the Planet Crafter, and let's see what I put in my inventory to remind me of what we're doing today. That's right, we're putting a teleporter in. Do I have a sea light? There it is. And the rod, yeah. And we're also going to put another optimizer in because we got a production multiplier fuse, and we might get more as we explore the lava area more today. But I thought we could put that production multiplier fuse in over at the trade platform by the methane, just for now. We can move it later if we wanna. Uh, you know what, right there probably fit. It does fit right there, perfect. It doesn't need to go around that. That produces instantly. That's this is not gonna help that, but it, it will help these. If we put this in there, we can see it's highlighting those. It is not highlighting, even though it's in range, this, because why would it? I wonder if there's a way we could speed up rockets Anyway, does, we don't need to do that. We're, we're getting good results on our rockets. In fact, if we head over here, that's about to go up. What can we buy for 5,000? What was the thing that I want one more of? Was it a production multiplier fuse? I think it was. I want a lot of these total. We don't need much more energy ones. If we ever need more of these, we'll, we'll buy them. But for now, these ones, whoops, I didn't mean to, whatever. We're a couple short. <laughs> All right, let's head home. Uh, we're gonna put a teleporter in over there. We've got water and food to bring with us and we'll take a sip on the way out. So this should be the faster way over to, generic frog eggs? Uh, yeah, over to the volcano area. And it's a little bit, ooh, very, gorgeous during the day here. Uh, it's a little bit unfortunate that this update came out for where we are in our save because I'm very distracted by it and I am not progressing fish or frogs at all. Is that new? No, that's how it always was. Okay. So we do also want to take another peek around here for hidden golden crate or tunnel. Didn't find anything last time. Oh, hello. This is this is what I was looking for, probably. This is a tunnel, right? Yeah. It's and I was about to say it's empty, but it continues on here. Cool. Oh, lava frogs and a blue crate. Can I land here? Yeah, this looks safe to land on. Come on. Where'd it? Hmm. Hmm, that's weird. Oh, really basic stuff in this blue crate. Interesting. I'll take those, not the iridium. I will take the lava frog eggs. And anything else in here? Oh, there's more obsidian. Don't want. Ow, 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 ow. Okay, we can stand here. Okay. Uh, seems to be it. Let's take another peek around, though. Oh! Oh! Look down there! Okay. There's our golden crate. Somebody was right. It is underneath a lava flow. Ow! Got burned a little getting in here. Another one of those. Uh, just two regular blueprint microchips. These are not the best golden crate. Uh, blue and golden crates. Interesting. Weird stuff in these. Okay, we're putting in a teleporter so we can just pick up everything and delete it. No problemo. Does it continue on past here? No, I can't fit in there. All right, we're going to probably take a little bit of burning damage getting out. No? Okay, cool. Awesome, we found it. So it is the entrance to this cave is at negative 930 by 89 by negative 204. And we have an osmium storm happening. Blue and red looks pretty cool together. So I think, did we get an iron in any of that? We did not. 
Are, is there any line around here? It'd be nice to put up a tiny platform first for this. There we go. And yeah, I think we'll have it facing the wreck so we know where we're going when we get out of this thing. Whoops. We want that first, like I said. Something like that. It's the lava wreck. And yeah, let's drop stuff off at home. Did a little bit of cleaning out of the dump chest, but not much. So, frog eggs. Don't know where our other lava frog egg ended up. Yeah, we'll just dump everything in there for now. Take those back with us to explore the wreck. Ah, right. <laughs> okay. Flashlight on. <clears throat> so we already explored this way? Or, yes, we already explored sort of both ways. We just got full inventory when we got into this room here. Didn't even finish this chest here. Let's delete it so that if we're looking for stuff through walls, see. Locker storage. I haven't seen a locker storage yet, so there is a locker somewhere around there. If I go to delete again. Yeah, it's through this wall. So we can get over there somehow. There's another ladder up. This is where we just came in from, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I just want to make sure I didn't miss anything in this room. Okay. Ladder up. Crate. 500, that's better. I'll take all of that. And you know what we're gonna, oh, there's another blue crate there. But what we're gonna do is head back over to the left. There was a blue crate over there. And I don't know that we deleted it last time. No, we didn't. Or even finish emptying it. But now that we have a teleporter, I feel it might be important. Can we get these yet? No, they're either behind glass or they're just bugged out. It's fine, we got plenty of microchips. Flashlight off. We don't need that in here. Just dump everything and take the food and water back. I think I think that's going to be easier. In fact, let's eat one and drink one while we're here. Another storm. No, just windy music. Okay. <laughs> but you know, we never did go up the staircase. There's nothing up these things, is there? No. That would have been neat, though. A little hidden Easter egg for us. Can't get through there. Got that chest. We did not get this one yet. Whoops. Another blue crate over here. T4 mutagen. It's our first one of those to find in the wild. We can make them. But we have not done that yet. Okay, that will open probably when we find the fusion core. More ladders up. Lots of ladders up in this place. What I'm thinking is that to get past those... Ooh, hey, a loose rocket engine. To get past those doors that are locked and like half open that we, we can see through but can't get through. We probably have to go up one ladder and down another. Space food. Cool. No, I don't want that. Got way more than enough of those at home. Okay, so let's take another trip home. I think we have emptied this floor. We've explored. We have not looked for f fake doors yet, but I haven't seen any that scream to me. Delete. Nothing's highlighting. 
Yeah, all right, let's bring this stuff home. Then we'll go explore upstairs. Something else we could do with all this iron we have here is not bring it home yet. We'll just build a container. Like that. And we'll shove everything in. Take those. Saves us about 12 seconds. Okay, I don't know what we're stuck on there. There we go. So, uh, there was a ladder up on the left side. We started with the left side. We'll go... Was there a ladder up? Yes, there was. We'll take that one. So we can see through that door. Oh, I thought there was one like that over there too. No, I guess not. So this is our first spot up. We can't go through there. Can we delete it? No. That's our, oh, hey, there's the fusion core. How many does it take? Two, okay. What do we have here? Blue and red, These, those are really cool uh, visual assets. Shanga, oh, okay, I just never used them, that's why. Hey, methane, just, I've never seen loose methane. Cool. And those are, oh, there's another loose methane. Never seen those before. I mean, I knew we could drop them. We could put them on um, display cases if you wanted to see them. So there's another ladder down. That's probably one that we saw in the other room because it's on that side. So there's a door that we can see through but it doesn't seem to be anything in there. There's a lava wall in there. Okay, here's a room we can go in. Tree seed linfoli, linfolia. And it looks like a door that may, oh no, it seems broken. See, that one's got a, a hairline open as well. It would go into that room there. This is a really big floor. Uh, all right, let's keep looking. Four seed shangas. We don't need those, but may as well clear them out of the way here. Inventory's not full yet. Another ladder down. Okay. Hmm. So this should match, in theory, the two ladders we saw downstairs on the other side. Let's go take a peek at that. This is the one we came up. No other doors that we can go through. Okay, we'll go back to the other side. And where, oh, here's the first ladder up, and there's the second one. We'll go up this. And yeah, yeah, that's exactly where we are. We'll go down this one. And yeah, that's exactly where we are. Okay, so I think we have now explored everywhere that isn't Fusion Core opened. Let's check the second floor again. It is looking like we need to get some fusion cells. So let's head home and do that. We can take most of our stuff from the locker here. Uh, maybe all of it. We can take all of it and we'll leave the locker even. One circuit board, a couple of rocket engines. Nothing is in there yet. And we'll put the rest in here. And it's full. <laughs> well, fertilizer we have a spot for upstairs still. So we can take those out right away. But we still have to keep moving inventory over, unfortunately. That is T 
tedious and I don't want it. So it'll, it'll have to do. We'll have to deal with it not being put away for now. Okay. So, can we make two of these? We're going to need six pulsar quartz, a couple obsidians, and a couple osmiums. Those should be upstairs. Oops. Just in case we don't have those in pulsar. Oh, there's plenty of osmium there, so we'll do them one at a time. It's not osmium, um, obsidian. Okay, let's go. Yeah, whatever, we got water on us. Go open up this rack. Hmm, that looks weird from back there. That looked like a tube or something. Hydration low, whatever. Let me know when it's critical. <laughs> uh, ladder up. Fusion core. Hey, methane came back. And the Shanga. That's bizarre. That's really weird. We will lock those in. Let's see if these opened up in here. Oops, it did open up. And there is our big safe. Excellent. Oh, this one I expected to, and it did, didn't. Okay, but this one did. Cool. We'll have to check downstairs as well because there was that locker storage we couldn't get to before. So let's go find that after we loot our big safe here. <whistles> Lots of terror tokens again and another multiplier fuse. So we got 1100, 1600, 1700, 1800, 19, 24, 34, 84, 8,900 Terra Tokens. We'll just consume all those right away. Wow, it looks pretty cool in here with the lights off. Let's, like I said, though, let's go look downstairs. Let's see if that opened any doors down there. All right, critical, fine. I did say to warn me when it was critical. I suspected a door was gonna open. storage to delete there. Hmm. Here we go. Here we go. This is the room. 500 more tokens. I'll take everything in there as well. And the iron. There's that locker storage. Much more important though. Can we get these ones? We can get these ones. Let's see what's in the locker first. Lots of stuff, way too much stuff. Hmm. Yeah, we're gonna make a second trip, I guess. Because we want those technical debris as well. Uh, how do we get out of here? Oh yeah, okay, this way. That way, this one is a little bit more maze-like than the other ships. Didn't take me too long to get around. I think there was a bug early on with one of the early releases that uh, prevented the fusion core from, from rendering so you couldn't unlock those areas. That, that confused a lot of people. But that seemed not too bad once we did it for like 15 minutes. <laughs> To be fair, I don't think any of the other ships have ever taken us 15 minutes to explore. Wow, our rods are getting full. We can put in a whole bunch more tier three extractors, which we should probably get doing. 
Uh, and we've got production multiplier fuses out the wazoo. In fact, I think we should put uh, one level one each at uranium and uh, iridium and get those guys brewing. Let's store, let's look in here. Did we already cram a fuse in here? There's the fuse trophy effigy. Let's sort this stuff. Take that, put that away. There's a bunch more rods to put away. I don't know how these got in here. Laziness, laziness is the answer. Um, do that. And <clears throat> teleporters cost three of these each, right? Let's see. Double check on that math. Yes, they do. And a super ally rod and an osmium and a zeolite each. Ooh, ooh, we're all out of osmium. We're gonna have to go to the trade platform for that. Oh, we're, we're full on inventory too, so that's another reason I can't pick stuff up. Uh, we actually, we need all of those and one more. Which might be a problem, let's see. No, no problem at all. Okay. Two of these. Gotta put stuff away. We don't have room for two of those. We already have spillover bacteria in here, so let's get rid of these. That'll save some slots. Junk rockets. Do we have a spot for rockets? Yeah, it's got to be downstairs somewhere. We don't need those right now. That. What am I doing, fingers? Come on. One, two, three. So we need two osmium for the two teleporters. We need one more rod for the multiplier optimizer. And is that all of the fuses we have? Could be. We did drop off stuff here before. See, we have six of these eggs. We have three in the dump storage over there and three over here. They shouldn't have respawned as far as I'm aware. So that's a bit glitchy. That's fine though, I'm happy to have six glowy blue frogs. Okay. We need that. Drop off another bacteria. And let's go do this stuff. Let's go over to the trade platform. We need osmium from here. We'll head over to uranium first because it's pretty close by. And it's out of the way. We don't want to hit there last. Okay, so we have three tier three extractors over here already, which is fantastic. We're gonna put that there-ish. It should, if we put one of these in here. Highlight all three, yeah. And any more we build on this side as well, good. Let's go get Iridium. Oh, and a teleporter here as well. Should have brought some iron. There's gotta be some out here. 
titanium, titanium. Wow. Uh, finally. While we're here, we'll grab one for the Iridium Cave, too. And we're not going to be coy about this. We're just going to put this directly into the cave. <laughs> we're not going to try to get this outside. If we want to hop over to this place. We want to hop over to this place. Um, hmm. Order. Nope, that's not how you spell uranium. That's not either. There we go. Go back to the trade platform instead of walking. Grab a sip on the way to iridium. So I think we did a good job exploring the lava area now. We found the golden crate. We've fully explored the wreck as far as I'm aware. I mean, there's still more loot to grab, but we've explored it all. doesn't matter. Uh, but we do want to put in... Oh, I didn't bring the extra obsidian. That's okay. We have it at home. In fact, some right here. One, two, three. And we did bring enough for the teleporter so we can go straight back, like walking through a door. We're going to put this one here, so if we put more on that side, that they'll get multiplied too. All three? Yes, indeed. Perfect. Cool stuff. Uh, you know what? I actually want to go check on the trade platform because we sent up a recipe before. That should be back. Over here, I think. Yeah. Let's turn that back on to enabled so that launches automatically. That one is already on it. These are going to launch at basically the same time. Yeah, there it goes. Foop. Foop. Okay, so I don't think we turned these guys on yet. We did not. Let's do that. Uh, yeah. So, is there a bottleneck here? Yes, and it's on methane. Okay. <clears throat> Okay, we're going to put that in there then, because we desperately need it. <laughs> we should even, if we have it, we do, what we should have done before we launched anything, is maybe bought another one. Let's see, what can we unlock? I do want the dome, and we're getting there. I think, I think we should hold off. We're making good progress on these pulsar quartzes. What we should do instead is get five more things for this to multiply instead of worrying about more fuses. I think we got the resources for that. Let's go take a peek before we go. <clears throat> and we'll work on that on the weekend. We'll increase our production of pulsar quartz. Those things take circuit boards. I know that. Okay. Two zeolite, iridium, that's cheap. That is super cheap. So we want all of the super alloy. We want five of these. We need 10 super alloy total. Okay. 10 zeolite total. And iridium rods, is that it? 
Yeah, five iridium rods. Simple. Okay. Well, there we go. Now we have it on us, so I won't be able to forget what we're doing on the weekend. Because for me, I know this is Friday's video, but I'm recording this on Sunday, and I'm still sick. <laughs> Actually, I'm feeling a lot better today, a bit of a sore throat. But hopefully by the weekend, this will remind me what we're doing, and we'll go do it. But that's it for today, everybody. Until next time, have a good time.